Thanks a lot, Tom. We'll start off in uh, Meadville. Uh, this is a Chestnut Street, and we do have a lot of sunshine, uh, and the heat and the humidity uh, is on and in full swing. So here's the setup. When you look at uh, the atmospheric setup, so we have high pressure over top of us, and what high pressure is in the atmosphere is descending air, right? So it's sinking. Well, as that air sinks, it undergoes pr uh, compressional warming, which means it warms as it sinks. So you have sunshine speeding up all those little air molecules and they're running into each other and bumping into each other and all of that descends towards the surface where you and I live. So long story short, as long as this high is over top of us, we really heat up. Weather watchers, 85 right now, Penn State Barron, low 80s as you make your way towards Niagara Pier, 88 in Edinburgh, 86 in Waterford. Uh, numbers in the low 90s in North Meadville, 89 in Sagertown, 91 in Crossingville. One number really stands out. That's Youngsville at 72. They had a cooling shower and thunder shower roll through. 84 in Saybrook, Ludlow also at 84. Dew points will remain elevated up near 70. That's more typical of like Miami, Florida or the Everglades. And we do have this heat and humidity causing these scattered showers and thunder showers mainly away from the lake. Those will die off with sunset. And we kind of do that again tomorrow, just an isolated chance as we head into tomorrow afternoon. I think most of us will remain rain-free tomorrow. So down into the upper 60s and low 70s tonight, it'll be warm, it'll be steamy, hazy, hot, and humid. 94 tomorrow, real feel numbers mid and upper 90s, 70s tomorrow night. And we uh, continue here with uh, our trend of 90s. We will get some relief by the weekend, but short-lived. There will be some scattered showers and storms around, and we need the rain. But then mid to late week next week, it looks like we do this all again. Could be even hotter, too. YourErie.com. Click on weather for the latest updated forecast. Check out the WeatherCams interactive radar as well. Jill?